Hi and welcome back to freesciencelessons.co.uk. By the end of this video you should be able to calculate the number of bacteria in a population after a certain time. If you're a higher tier student you should be able to then express the number of bacteria using standard form. And all of this is for biology triple students only. We looked at bacteria in an earlier video. Remember that bacteria are prokaryotes. Their genetic information is not enclosed in a nucleus. Here's a key fact about bacteria. Bacteria multiply by simple cell division. In other words, one bacterial cell splits into two bacterial cells. Scientists call this process binary fission. Now bacteria can carry out binary fission once every 20 minutes, as long as they've got enough nutrients and the temperature suitable. Now what this means is that bacterial numbers can increase very rapidly indeed. In the exam, you could be asked to calculate the number of bacteria after a given time. Here's a sample question. Under ideal conditions, a type of bacterium divides every 20 minutes. Calculate the number of bacteria present after three hours. So to calculate the number of bacteria, we use this equation. The number of bacteria equals two to the power of n, where n is the number of rounds of division. Now, you're not given this equation in the exam, so it's important that you learn it. Now, the first thing we need to do is calculate how many times the bacteria have divided in three hours. Three hours is 180 minutes. The bacteria divide every 20 minutes. 180 divided by 20 tells us that the bacteria have underwent nine rounds of division. So the number of bacteria equals two to the power of nine. This tells us that we've got 512 bacteria present after three hours. Now, if you're doing the higher paper, then you need to be able to express your answer in standard form. To do this, start by taking the first digit, in this case a five. Now count the number of digits after that. In this case, we've got two more digits. So 512 is 5.12 times 10 to the power of two. Here's a question for you. Under ideal conditions, a type of bacterium divides every 20 minutes. Calculate the number of bacteria present after eight hours. So pause the video now and try this yourself. Okay, so first we need to calculate the number of rounds of division. Eight hours is 480 minutes. The bacterium divides once every 20 minutes. Dividing 480 by 20 tells us that we have 24 rounds of division. The number of bacteria is two to the power of n, where n is the number of rounds of division. So two to the power of 24 tells us that we've got 16,777,216 bacteria. Putting this into standard form gives us a value of 1.678 times 10 to the power of seven, and that's to three decimal places. Remember, you'll find plenty of questions on bacterial division in my vision workbook, and you can get that by clicking on the link above. Okay, so hopefully now you should be able to calculate the number of bacteria in a population after a certain time. If you're a higher tier student, you should be able to express the number of bacteria using standard form.